Welcome back to our discussion in Parabola. This time, we're going to tackle the parabola with vertex at 0, 0 or point of origin. This time, the, the parabola opens to the right. And so, if the parabola opens to the right and its vertex is at point of origin, the standard equation of our parabola would be y squared equals 4ax. So this is the sketch of our parabola with vertex at 0, 0 and it opens to the right. Now, from the standard equation y squared equals 4ax, so we have to compute for a the value of a because again, it will be the distance between the vertex and the focus. So here is our vertex at point of origin, 0, 0. Since our parabola opens to the right, and therefore, the axis of symmetry of our parabola would be the x-axis. Therefore, our, fo our focus will be inside the curve or inside the parabola, which lies along or on the positive x-axis. So this is our focus. And our focus is has a distance of a from the vertex. So from the vertex... At this focus, the distance is A. So, if our vertex is 0, 0, going to focus, that means we move a unit of A to the right. The movement is horizontal. That means the coordinates that will change in value from vertex is only its X coordinate. So, kung ang vertex natin ay 0, 0, yung x-coordinate lang ng vertex natin ang mababago para maging coordinates ng focus natin. So, ang movement natin is horizontal to the right. Therefore, itong x-coordinate natin will have now, the focus now will have the coordinates A, 0. So, this will be the coordinates of our focus na bago lang yung x-coordinate kasi the movement is horizontal. And this is positive because from vertex to focus, the movement is to the right. So, in number line, kapag papunta tayo ng right, right side, it is always positive. So, this time now, if the coordinates of our focus is A, 0, let us now determine the coordinates of the two endpoints of the lattice rectum. Now, our curve or the parabola opens to the right. That means the curve is like this. From focus, going to either of the end point of the latus rectum, we're going to move either upward or downward. So the end, po the end points of the latus rectum lies vertically with the focus. So let's say, starting from focus, and we're going to determine the end po the coordinates of the end point of the lattice rectum on the top or upright so uh, on uh, on top of focus or let's say this is the end point of the lattice rectum the movement is vertical so the distance from focus to the lattice end point of the lattice rectum is 2a since the movement is vertical, vertically upward, the coordinate that will change from the focus is only the y coordinate. So this will become plus 2a. So the coordinates now of this endpoint of the lattice rectum on top is a negative 2a. Kasi ang movement natin from focus is upright, up, is upward, and siya ay positive. And ang nababago, dahil siya ay upward or vertical, yung y-coordinate ng focus ang nabagong value. Now, from focus, downward, going to the uh, end point of the lattice rectum, the movement is vertically downward. So this time, kung downward ang movement natin, therefore, negative. So the Coordinates now of our lattice rectum, end point of the lattice rectum, would be A, negative 2A. Negative kasi downward. 
And so, this is now our vertex, focus, and the two endpoints of the lattice rectum. And now, when it comes to the directrix of our lattice rectum that opens to the right with vertex at 0, 0, again, the distance between the vertex and the directrix is, is the same as the distance between vertex and the focus. So if this is A, this should also be A. And as I said earlier, the axis of symmetry of parabola of our parabola here is the x-axis. So therefore, our directrix should be behind the curve. That means the directrix should be perpendicular to the negative or to the x-axis. And it lies along the negative x-axis. So, ito siya ngayon. And the distance is A. Since we form a vertical line, broken vertical line, the directrix now has an equation x equals negative A. Because coming from vertex to the directrix, the movement is towards the left side. So, negative yung A. That is why this is now the equation of our so this time, let us now solve a problem or example or sketch an example of a parabola that opens to the right. So our given equation is y squared equals 12x. So our given standard equation is y squared equals 12, 12x. This is the same as the standard equation y squared equals 4ax. And therefore, as you can see here, our 4x, 4a rather, is the 12. So we can equate 4a equals 12. That means our a has a value of 3 units and our 2a will be 6. Now, that means the uh, the distance between our vertex to the focus is 3 units. And since this opens to the right, so this is the sketch. This is our y-axis. And this is our x-axis. At the point of origin is our vertex. So from the vertex, 3 units to the right. 1, 2, 3. So this is our focus with the, which has now the coordinates 3 and 0. So, vertex 0, 0. Focus has the coordinates 3, 0. Now, sabi natin that the distance between focus to one of the endpoints of the lattice rectum is 6. Or, or rather, is equal to 2a. And this, in this case, our 2a is equal to 6. Now, from the focus, which has the coordinates 3, 0, Kukunin natin yung endpoint na sa taas. So, the movement is vertically upward. That means, we will change the value of the y-coordinate of our focus with the value to a positive because it is upward from focus to the endpoint upward. Okay? So, that means we're going to have 6 units upward. So, the coordinates now of our endpoint of this, of the lattice rectum, this one will be 3 and 6. Positive 6. Because, hindi naman tayo gumalaw horizontally, kaya hindi nababa yung x-coordinate. The movement from the focus is vertical. That is why ang nababa yung y-coordinate. So, from 3, 0, it becomes 3, 6. And then, if we're going to get the coordinates of the endpoint of the lattice rectum here, down here, the movement is vertically downward. So from the focus, which has the coordinates 3, 0, you move 6 units downward. So that means your x coordinate will not change. It will remain as 3. And your y coordinate from 0, it will now become negative 6. Negative because you are going down. Okay? Vertically Downward. So this one now has the coordinates 3, negative 6. So you have now the vertex, the focus, and the coordinates of the two lattice rectum. Don't forget, 
the distance between this end point and this end point and the focus is 2a that is 6 as well as this one now let us now determine the dielectrics or the equation of the dielectrics so the distance between vertex and the dielectric is also equal to a which is 3 but this time it should be behind the curve so that means we will be having a dielectric which is perpendicular along or perpendicular to the negative y-axis. Okay? So this is 3 units. 1, 2, 3. So our A is 3. So therefore, the equation now of our dielectric would be x equals negative 3. Negative because we move from vertex going to the dielectric to the left by 3 units. So this is the sketch of our parabola that opens to the right with the vertex at 0, 0 with the standard equation y squared equals 12x.